be a food review for Taco Bell. Taco Bell has two new items. They brought back, guess what? The Mexican pizza. Have you had the Mexican pizza? I remember the Mexican pizza back in the 90s. I do actually, and uh, it was interesting. It was interesting. <laughs> Did I miss it? Uh, no, because I do have another preference, but uh, it was okay. I've never tried it, and one of the reasons why, because it comes with beans. I know you can substitute it, but why pay full price when you have to start taking out stuff? So, yeah. But anyways, since he is an expert on Taco Bell, he loves Taco Bell. Oh, what do you know? Ooh. What do you know? Nice shirt, by the way. So if you, for, for those of you that don't know, this is my cousin, Adam. He joins me on food reviews because as you know, I can't eat everything on my own. And he, and, he, and he loves Taco Bell, like loves it. <laughs> so you all know what time it is. It's, it's splashing, splashing time. time. Yay. Splash me some hot sauce. Yay. <laughs> So let's get on to this food review before it gets cold. So we have Mexican pizza. So the good thing about it, I ordered everything on the Taco Bell app. I had a free reward. So I got one for free, which was uh, no substitutions. I got it the way it came. So that would be for him because it has beans. So this is the Mexican pizza. Mm. Okay, uh, okay, I think. Uh, okay, so this one says beans. Can you see that? Yeah, that one says beans. I believe this is for you, sir. Beans for the beans. <laughs> and should, did you show the audience how the pizza looks? I'm going to, I'm the going to. pizza looks. Wow, very interesting. Oh, it looks like somebody took a bite out of it, but <laughs> look. I had a little visitor. Someone took a bite out of it. <laughs> Mine's came clean. Oh, mine wow. has beans. Oh, mine doesn't have beans. Couldn't think of a right. <laughs> hmm. So yeah. now, now, what? How would? How can they make a Italian pizza? Because pizzas came from Italian. How can they make an Italian pizza or a pizza, and make it Mexican? -y? What does that mean? Like, just because we had like what, cheese? It's not like, just cheese. I think it has three different types of cheese and tomato. So then that would maybe and maybe the Mexican. sauce. Maybe it's the sauce. So it's like I have some hot sauce. So now the Italians went to Mexican. Yeah. So, now it's so Mexican let's pizza. let's get the info right. Let me see. Does that make sense? No, I get it. I get it. I mean, it's like they can make something and put like something put jalapenos and then now it's a Mexican something. That's like, true. Oh, okay, but great. it does say it has seasoned beef beans three cheese blend which you see the white the yellow and there's probably two whites because i only see one yellow and then they have the mexican pizza sauce with tomato so that's the difference it's the mexican oh, pizza sauce oh, i see it's actually the size about a 4k <laughs> but a lot thinner than the 4k so uh, yeah, i'm yeah. just saying that's a comparison for those of you <laughs> <laughs> or if you want to compare DVDs, DVDs, it's just... It's be careful, please. Be careful. Oh, this is the old one. Let's, let's, try let's, let's, let's try to eat your food, please. Let's try to eat your food. Who's going to go first? Try you go first. Mexican pizza. Yeah, so try it as it is without adding anything and give me your honest oh. opinion. Because on this That's channel, we give our honest opinion. We don't want to offend anybody, so don't take it personal what we say, okay? Correct. <laughs> Correct. So the pizza in the bottom comes with the uh, carne, carne with the uh, mystery meat or the ground beef and then the uh, refried beans at the bottom. So take a bite and let the viewers know your thoughts on the Mexican All pizza. Right, here we go. One American eating <laughs> la pizza. See, <clears throat> let's see. Here we go. As everyone says on YouTube, going in. It just sounds kind of weird, but okay. And the shirt wasn't planned. I, I had no idea he was going to wear that shirt and would cut off the leaves. <laughs> but it looks good. Looks good. You lovely ladies. <laughs> if I have any female viewers. <laughs> mm, it's um, it's uh, pretty good. 
Yeah, well, it, it basically reminds me of uh, two tostadas put together like that. And okay. Then basically, which is good. Um, but, um, I mean, it's good. I mean, it's good, with, like, uh, for those men out there. If you get filled up on this, probably not, you know, because we normally eat, like, maybe, like, four or five tostadas. So you probably want to order, but being five bucks in the state of California, this pizza, yeah. uh, I'd rather get more of a Isn't taco it? that's a little more fatter with stuff. So, but, um. But, uh, you know. Yeah, it's around that price, yep. But. It's pretty good. And so that one does have beans? Hmm, oh yeah, I forgot about it. Um, yeah, I guess very. Actually, I don't even see Aw, man, hold on. Um, see him? Oh, my goodness. Does that one have beans? Yes. Oh. <sighs> okay. So, swap, swap. This one they said yeah. beans, but then I guess now that I see it, is there's a minus, so no, be maybe for negative means no beans. Uh, oh my goodness. Adding and subtracting, ah. just like in kindergarten. Mm, this one's know. beans. Yeah. Beans just... for Mr. Beans. Mr. Beans. So, ooh, this one feels a little more heavy weight. Yeah, well, it yeah. has beans. Beans are cheap. Beans are cheap, man. You can just, you know. Oh like, my yeah. God. So you go ahead and try one. That one is number. This one has. This one has. Oh my God. Free, free uh, holes. Oh my God. If it like fell apart. Oh, I taste the free, free hole. Oh. Mm. You know what? I think by eating this Mexican pizza, I I think my Spanish actually improved. It's pretty good. Free holes. Oh, me gusta mucho la tostada mexicana con frijoles. Wow, I speak fluent Spanish. Great, great, great. And I gotta make a choice because there's dos mujeres and only one camino. Huh. That makes sense. But anyways, it's it's good. It's good, but for five bucks, uh, I personally rather get something more fitting, like the uh, like the chalupa, hmm. or the cheesy gordita, or even like a, a burrito supreme. Yeah, it's not but, bad. Uh, it's not like oh, oh my god. I just think people. Well, I guess everybody has their preference. I think like if you're leaving the club and stuff like that, and you have the munchies, then this is probably something you'll crave. But if I had to choose between this and a Crunchwrap Supreme, I'm going to pick oh, the yeah, Crunchwrap because they're both the same price. Yeah, and it's a little more filling, I would think, because right. of the tea. I mean, this right. is good, don't get me wrong. I'm not bashing it. It's good. But um, did I miss it when they took it away? Honestly, no. And uh, when you say pizza, then I would have like a like a real pizza. You know what I mean? Pepperoni, mm -hmm. you know, bell peppers, and mushrooms. Yeah, we, um, but the Mexican, the, the Mexican. Oh my God! No, I can't speak Spanish. Oh, oh, oh. The Mexican. So then I speak now fluent. She yeah, it just disappeared. Español, español. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's um, it's almost gone. Oh my God! But um, I got some some guacamole. Did that come with that? No, I paid eighty five cents extra. Oh, I see. Okay. But I mean, see if it gives a little boost. I mean, it's good. I mean, better, you know. 85 cents for this little thing. Mm. That's right. 85 cents. So will that be under a pound? Oh my god. It's like almost gone. I know you took a bite, but damn. It's like pretty much gone. So. It's gone. <laughs> Taco Bell has a... Another new item, it's a drink. It's called Dragon Paradise Iced Tea. Ooh. It, it's a sparkling sweet hibiscus tea with dragon fruit, raspberry, and blackberry flavors. That means more than one. Would you like to try this? Now you're allergic to blackberries, is that correct? That is correct. Mm, so, unless you have 911 on speed dial, I cannot have them. Dragon food for the dragon yeah. belt. What the woohoo! <laughs> Let's see if you want some strawberry. Oh my god! Well, excuse you. 
Excuse you. <laughs> oh. Take your mind out of the gutter, please. <laughs> no. Keep it PG-13. You keep it PG-13. Dra now, doesn't this remind you of the dragon fruit of Starbucks? Yes. Like it's like a wood leg version, except that hot. It's purple too. Okay. Oh, here we go. Like they say in YouTube. Go in it. So that alone is $2.29, but I got the combo box, which was $8.99 and included the drink. Hmm, interesting. Okay. I taste, it reminds me of grape. I taste grape. Grape. Even though it's berry. Ay. I'm tasting grape, which is good, which is fine. I like the grape soda. So. It's good actually. It just tastes like kind of like grape soda. So uh, it's good. It's like a soda, you know, like a, like Welch's grape soda, something like that. Yeah, I don't drink soda either. Haven't drank soda in since 2017 it's or good. 2018 actually. Good. I can dig it. I can dig it. Yeah. So it's not bad. Yeah, it's good. But I mean, if I had to pick one, I'm a Coca-Cola type of guy. You know what I mean? Gotta support the Coca-Cola. And uh, another thing I'm touching, just like the, the Coca-Cola is my preference in their secret ingredient but uh it's good i mean it's good if they took it away would it be like oh no like no because it's just just get a rush of soda and that's it so, but, wow this meat is so seasoned but look it, it finished right away the meat is very seasoned also so since taco bell brought back the mexican pizza what do you hope that they bring out what quite frankly my dear i don't give a damn no, uh, actually, they took away, for those of you who are familiar with the Taco Bell uh, world, they took away the double-decker taco. Now, that was, I was very addicted to it. That was very good. I liked it, and it was very filling, because it was a crunchy taco inside a flour tortilla that had refried beans on the inside. And it was kind of filling, and it was very good. I've been eating it since, like, the early 2000s, late 90s, quite frankly. And when I would go to talk about, I would only order that. I know it's kind of weird, but I would only order that. And they took it away, man. Can you believe that? I was so sad. So I would hope they would bring that back. But uh, there's like a bootleg version, and it's called the Cheesy Gordita. Basically the same thing, except uh, it's like a pita bread instead of flour tortilla. Yeah. And then they put cheese on the inside of the pita bread instead of refried beans. And that's it. So that's the same thing. But Yeah, the... Yeah. Yeah. For three cheesy gorditas, it was thirteen forty seven. Oh wow! Yeah, the Mexican pizza is four ninety nine. That's five pesos. You want to show them five your pesos. cheesy gordita? Oh yeah, is it this one? Right? Mm hmm. All three of them are yours. Ooh. Do you want hot sauce, mild or fire? Yeah. That means yeah. <laughs> Does it? Yeah. Nine means probably no. I don't know. I see. Looks like somebody slept during history class. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So here's the cheesy gordita. <laughs> I'm sure if you those know what it is. It's basically like uh, the little thicker. It almost it reminds me of pita bread, quite frankly. And then obviously they put cheese in it. I mean, you know, a little cheese on it. And then it's the crunchy taco. And then just the standard issue taco. But then they seem to put sauce, which I just noticed now after years of eating it, that they just put a. Uh, <laughs> Some type of crema, some type of cream sauce on the gordita. Oh, I didn't realize that. Oh, wow. Give the viewers a close-up. I didn't, I didn't realize that. Can you believe that? So, but, I mean, it's good. I'm sure. Is it like sriracha, creamy sriracha? Uh, or is it just ranch? It or? tastes kind of mayonnaise -y. Uh, Oh, I'm tasting a little spice. Okay, so maybe it's like a spicy. Sriracha. Like a Southwest Chipotle. Like how oh, there you go. Like a Subway has it. But this one's not orange as well. So it's like a little spicy cream sauce, whatever. You got what I'm saying, right? Right. So, but other than that, it's good. So, we better bring up the oh. heavy guns. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I didn't open it yet. No. All right, that's fine. I'll do it later. So, this is what I normally get since I lost my double burger tacos. It's hard to say, but you can't see that five times. And uh, so now I get this primarily. And uh, that's all I always usually get. Or country wrap, sometimes a burrito to change it up. But I, I really like these. And, uh, <laughs> I can't believe my voice still sounds like this. So anyway, it's okay. It's okay. Am I eating this in front of the studio audience? Yes, of course. Great. great. This is a food review. Great. Here we go. 
Give the people what they want to see. <laughs> you guys really want to see me eat comida? Hey. Comida? Mm. Oh, I forgot to measure it. So it's about the size of a 4K. Oh, a little, MG. A little, oops, oops, it's a oh, oh, MG. It's about the size of a. Oh, yeah, the devil. Double this. I don't have a double this here, but you know. But if you want to like double up, let's see. I'm sorry. And I just backed you. Three, <laughs> so it's about oh the size. Well, you know, but maybe about two, aye, two, aye, aye. two DVDs, fatness. Two DVDs, fatness wise. Oh, so please, it's big, please be careful. Please. Anyway. When you come over, I, I gotta like put some stuff away because. <laughs> oh my God. So, what I got, which I found very interesting. Normally the box is $9.99, but I got the toasted cheddar chalupa deluxe box for $8.99, which chalupa. Really? it comes with this, mm. but of course, since I don't drink soda or can't have that, so I'm allergic to anything raspberry or blackberry. Oh my God, like I forgot, I forgot, I can't even open the box. <laughs> Wasn't the box more expensive? Yeah, before it was $9.99 and people would say, oh, it's the $5 box. No, it ain't. Not in LA. Over here, it's always, was it $6.99 and then $9.99. Yeah, so this is a shocker that it's $8.99. So, of course, well, at least this is went down because, you know, gas prices are through the roof. Mm -hmm. So it comes with your chips. Your nacho cheese. It comes with your crunchy taco. You want want to open that, please? And it comes with a five layer burrito. It I didn't customize it, um, so it does have beans, so it'll probably be for oh. him. And then so this is a standard issue crunchy taco. Nothing really special, just the uh, taco. Mm -hmm. Who sabes? Oops. Ooh, this looks divine. So this is the cheddar chalupa. Look at all. Oh, ah! Look at that goodness. So that means the cheddar has been fried onto like the crisp, thing? Like yeah. spray painted on? Look at that goodness. Like, like pasted Ooh, on? Look at that. Look at all the vibrant colors. Ooh. Nice. Take a bite of this. Mmm. Oh wow. Was that always around or did that come back? The crispy sides. I think mean, it came back. I'm not that sure. Wasn't around. They took it away. Because I remember a while ago it was around and then I just mm. never ordered it. So, Man, that's good. You know. Ah! My food just fell in the background. It's the ghost of mm. Gettysburg. Hip hip. All right. So the Mexican pizza wasn't bad at all. I thought I was going to be disappointed, but will I pay that much? Probably not. I'll do the Crunchwrap Supreme. Any last comments? About the uh, comida that we yes. just ate? <laughs> Man, that's good. Woo! Uh, well, besides that it costed like about 60 to 70 bucks, uh, it was pretty good. I think, no? Mm -hmm. I think so. Wow, that is awesome. That is amazing. Oh, yeah. Thumbnail. Oh, my God. Ooh. Eskimo kisses. Thumbnail. That is amazing. Amazing. Well, thank you all for watching. We want to cut this video to an end. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And before I go, I just want to say thank you to all my old and new subscribers. Much appreciated for supporting my channel. I'm hoping to hit the 1K mark, hopefully, by the end of the year, hopefully. Speaking and also, as of today, um, Play Nintendo guy hit 1K, isn't oh, that all? Yeah. Oh, wow. So congratulations. Oh, wow. <laughs> Nintendo <laughs> Super Mario 2. You know, I used to have a Nintendo, although I don't, uh, am I that old? I guess I am. Huh? The original Nintendo, but I threw it away, but anyways. But <laughs> Legend of Zelda, I dug it. I loved it, so. Okay. Bye, everybody. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Leave your lovely comments below. 
and I will get back to you on all your comments and I'll see you all in a few days. Bye. Bye. Hanging up now. <laughs>